Hi, my name is Daniel Walter, uh, coach here at CLC. I'm uh, 26 years old and I came over to the gym and started coaching um, last year, so March 2016 roughly. I was working out a few months before that. So my, I guess, journey to CrossFit or how I kind of found it, um, I was working out at a gym out in Pataskala, Ohio. Um, with one of my mentors, if you will, and doing kind of like the bodybuilding style workouts. Um, some high intensity stuff, but not a whole lot. Um, he actually um, had an athlete for his company. Um, so he actually owned the original Rogue Fitness in Gahanna. So I ended up trying to give that a shot because it was 15 minutes from where I was going to college. Um, so I started in the late summer of 2011 for CrossFit. Um, so I definitely um, noticed it was better for my body type. I was under runner, what I was trying to be before. So, um, and then kind of how that progressed, uh, we moved down to Grandview, which became CrossFit Grandview. Uh, Brandon and Graham were the owners at that time. Um, and I decided to get my uh, CrossFit level one um, at the end of my senior year of college. Um, and then from there, I moved to Illinois and that's when I began coaching. So I think it was 2012 um, at CrossFit Amplify. Um, at, so that was just west of the city, about 30, 40 minutes. Um, really tight knit group there, uh, lots of community. Um, so I kind of just fell in love with it there and then kind of just when we came back to Ohio that's when I started the conversation with, uh, with Brian and Rachel uh, when the opportunity came up. So I guess my favorite thing to coach first off um, is definitely going to be the Olympic movements. Um, I don't know I kind of became fascinated when I started to learn them just because they're kind of hard. <laughs> I mean they're definitely hard and technical so I like to help people kind of break the lift down to simplify it and then you know work their way up to what whatever the movement they're doing so um, that's one of my favorite things and then I just simply like to see somebody that like literally couldn't do something and just watching them grow and progress on um, to whatever goal um, and finding out what what they want to, what they want out of it so um, it's a little bit of prime, but uh, if you kind of start the conversation, usually they're going to tell you. Um, there's usually one or two movements that they really want to work towards. So I'll kind of take note of that and try to help them reach that goal. So as far as like what advice would I give to somebody that is kind of scared of the bar or intimidated by CrossFit, um, just realize that A, you're not alone. You're probably seeing the 1% of CrossFitters on TV or ESPN2, um, which they're just freak shows. Um, realize that basically no one at a typical gym is going to be like that or a very small percentage. So there's always a starting point with something and just realize it's, it's a process. Um, you're not gonna come in here doing like the most advanced gymnastic movement or you're not gonna be cleaning 315 pounds or something like that. So just realize that there is a, a starting point and that's the coach's responsibility to recognize that and to talk to you about that and to determine like where what is a safe um, place for you to start. And then from there, you can progress up from there. Um, so if you're scared of the bar, for instance, you know, we can do something with dumbbells or something like that, just so we can keep you in good positions. Um, and I think you will start to want to use a barbell, just being around everyone that is using a bar. 
Um, so that's that's kind of what I would say there. 